Imagine walking into a place where the very air vibrates with centuries of prayer, where every stone is a witness to moments of profound devotion, sacrifice, and resurrection. Welcome to the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, a sanctuary that stands at the crossroads of history, faith, and mystery, inviting all who enter to embark on a journey through time and spirit. Nestled in the heart of Jerusalem, the Church of the Holy Sepulchre is a site revered by millions of Christians worldwide. It is believed to encompass both Golgotha, where Christ was crucified, and the tomb where he was buried and rose again. This ancient structure is not just a building, it is a living, breathing testament to the enduring power of faith. Over the centuries, it has drawn pilgrims from every corner of the globe, all seeking to connect with the divine and walk in the footsteps of Christ. The church pulsates with an energy that is both mystical and deeply moving, as the scent of incense mingles with whispered prayers and the flickering light of candles. Today, we will delve into the rich history, traditions, and enduring mysteries that make the Church of the Holy Sepulchre one of the most significant religious sites in the world. The Church of the Holy Sepulchre has a history that stretches back nearly two millennia. Its significance is rooted in the events of the Passion of Christ, making it the most sacred site in Christianity. According to tradition, this is the place where Jesus was crucified, laid to rest, and ultimately resurrected. The church stands on the site identified by Saint Helena, the mother of Emperor Constantine, in the early 4th century. After converting to Christianity, Constantine sent Helena to Jerusalem to locate the places associated with the life and death of Jesus. Her search led to the discovery of the true cross and the sites of Christ's crucifixion and burial. In 326 AD, Constantine ordered the construction of a grand basilica to enshrine these holy sites, marking the beginning of the Church of the Holy Sepulchre's long and complex history. Over the centuries, the Church has faced numerous challenges, including destruction, rebuilding, and restoration. The original basilica was damaged during the Persian invasion of 614 AD and later destroyed by the Fatimid Caliph al-Hakim in 1009 AD. However, it was rebuilt and expanded by the Crusaders in the 12th century, giving the Church much of its current form. Despite these challenges, the Church of the Holy Sepulchre has remained a central place of pilgrimage for Christians worldwide. Each stone within its walls whispers tales of faith, sacrifice, and resurrection, echoing the voices of countless believers who have sought solace and connection to the divine within its sacred confines. One of the most significant and awe-inspiring events at the Church of the Holy Sepulchre is the annual Holy Fire Ceremony, held on Holy Saturday, the eve of Orthodox Easter. This ancient tradition, which dates back over a thousand years, is a moment of profound spiritual significance for the Orthodox Christian community. Pilgrims from around the world gather within the Church, their anticipation reaching fever pitch as they await the miraculous event. The atmosphere is thick with expectation, as the faithful believe that the holy fire is a divine light that descends from heaven. The ceremony begins with the Greek Orthodox Patriarch entering the Edicule, the small chapel that enshrines the tomb of Christ. The doors of the Edicule are sealed, and the Patriarch is left alone to pray for the holy fire to descend. Moments later, he emerges, holding two candles ablaze with the holy fire. The sight is met with cries of joy and reverence from the crowd, as the flame is quickly passed from candle to candle, illuminating the darkened church with a wave of fervent hope. Each flickering light represents a prayer, a wish, and a connection to the divine, symbolizing the resurrection of Christ and the renewal of faith. The holy fire is believed to be a miraculous event, with the flame said to be of divine origin. In the first few minutes after its appearance, it is claimed that the fire does not burn, allowing pilgrims to pass their hands through the flames without being harmed. This belief adds to the sense of wonder and reverence that surrounds the ceremony. The holy fire is not just a symbol of hope and renewal. It is a powerful expression of the enduring faith that has sustained the Christian community for centuries. The Church of the Holy Sepulchre is unique not only for its religious significance but also for its complex governance. The Church is shared by six Christian denominations, Greek Orthodox, Roman Catholic, Armenian Apostolic, Coptic Orthodox, Ethiopian Orthodox, and Syriac Orthodox. Each denomination has its own specific areas within the church and its own times for conducting services. This intricate system of governance is governed by an agreement known as the status quo, which has been in place since 1852. 
The status quo is a set of rules and traditions that dictate everything from the precise times of worship to the cleaning and maintenance responsibilities within the church. It ensures that each denomination has its own space and time to conduct services, while also preventing conflict by requiring consensus on all decisions. However, this delicate balance of power is not without its challenges. The need for consensus means that even minor decisions, such as replacing a broken window or repairing a section of the church, can become major points of contention, leading to delays and disagreements. The governance of the Church of the Holy Sepulchre is a delicate dance of diplomacy and tradition. While the status quo has helped to maintain peace within the church, it has also created a fragile balance that can be easily disrupted. Tensions between the different denominations occasionally flare up, fueled by historical grievances and differing interpretations of the status quo. Despite these challenges, the church remains a place of profound spiritual significance, drawing pilgrims from around the world to experience its unique atmosphere and connect with the divine. Beyond the challenges of governance, the Church of the Holy Sepulchre faces the formidable task of maintaining its ancient structure. Centuries of exposure to the elements, combined with the impact of earthquakes and past conflicts, have taken a toll on the building. The Edicule, the heart of the church and the site of Christ's tomb, has been identified as particularly unstable, prompting urgent restoration efforts. In 2016, a major restoration project was undertaken to reinforce the Edicule, which had been at risk of collapse. The project, which involved experts from around the world, was a testament to the ongoing efforts to preserve this sacred site for future generations. The restoration work was not just a matter of structural stability. It was a labor of love, driven by the desire to protect a place that holds deep spiritual significance for millions of people. The challenges faced by the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, whether structural or political, highlight a profound truth. The true essence of this holy site transcends its physical form. The worn stones, the scent of incense, and the flickering candlelight all serve as tangible connections to a story that has resonated through millennia. This church is more than just a building. It is a living, breathing testament to the enduring power of faith, a place where history, religion, and human experience intertwine to create an atmosphere of profound significance. The Holy Fire Ceremony, while a cherished tradition, has also been the subject of scrutiny and debate. Skeptics and believers alike have questioned the origins and nature of the Holy Fire, leading to a perpetual dialogue that has spanned centuries. Some argue that the Holy Fire is a cleverly orchestrated hoax, with claims that the Greek Orthodox Patriarch uses a hidden source of fire within the Edicule. Others point to scientific anomalies surrounding the event, such as electromagnetic disturbances recorded during the ceremony, and witnesses who claim that their candles spontaneously ignited. Despite these debates, the Holy Fire continues to captivate the imagination and inspire awe. For many, it represents a divine miracle, a tangible connection to the resurrection of Christ and the presence of the divine in the world. Whether viewed as a miracle or a mystery, the Holy Fire embodies the duality of faith and reason, inviting believers and skeptics alike to grapple with the nature of belief and the limits of human understanding. The enduring mystery of the Holy Fire is emblematic of the broader mystery that surrounds the Church of the Holy Sepulchre. This sacred space is a place where faith intersects with history, where the seen and unseen converge, and where the boundaries between the physical and the spiritual blur. It is a place that invites us to contemplate the nature of belief, to embrace the unknown, and to seek out the divine in the midst of the everyday. The Church of the Holy Sepulchre stands as a beacon of faith, a symbol of hope, and a testament to the possibility of resurrection and renewal. For centuries, it has drawn pilgrims from all corners of the globe, each seeking to connect with the divine and experience the profound spiritual atmosphere that permeates the church. The journey to the Church of the Holy Sepulchre is often one of deep personal significance, as pilgrims walk the path that Christ himself is believed to have taken, culminating in the sacred space where their faith finds its most profound resonance. Within the church's walls, Differences in culture, background, and belief fade into the background, as shared humanity takes center stage. The Church of the Holy Sepulchre serves as a meeting point for people from all walks of life, united by a common quest for meaning and connection. In the quiet moments of reflection within its ancient walls, one can feel the weight of centuries of prayer, the collective yearning for something greater than ourselves, and the hope that transcends time. 
The Church of the Holy Sepulchre is not just a place of historical and religious significance. It is a living testament to the enduring power of belief. Its very existence is a reminder that, despite the challenges and divisions of the world, faith and hope have the power to bring people together, to heal, and to inspire. The Church stands as a monument to the resilience of the human spirit, a place where the story of Christ's passion, death, and resurrection continues to resonate with people across the ages. As we conclude our journey through the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, we are reminded that this sacred space is far more than just an ancient building. It is a living, breathing testament to the enduring power of faith, a place where the physical and the spiritual intersect, and where the mysteries of the divine are brought to life. The Church's rich history, profound traditions, and the enduring mystery of the Holy Fire all contribute to its unique atmosphere, a place of deep reflection, spiritual renewal, and connection with the divine. In the heart of Jerusalem, the Church of the Holy Sepulchre stands as a beacon of hope and a symbol of the possibility of resurrection and renewal. Its stones bear witness to centuries of devotion, sacrifice, and resurrection, and its walls echo with the prayers of millions of believers. This sacred space invites us to confront the mysteries of faith, to embrace the unknown, and to seek out the divine connection that transcends time and space. As we reflect on the profound significance of the Church of the Holy Sepulchre, let us remember that it is not just the stones or the rituals that give it meaning, but the unwavering spirit of those who continue to seek and find hope within its walls. This ancient sanctuary, with its rich history and deep spiritual resonance, will continue to inspire awe, wonder, and devotion for generations to come.